Hello students, today we are going to verify the total surface area of a square within help of an activity. To verify this activity, the material required are ball representing a spherical object, cardboards, glue, brush, scissors, compass, rubber, sharpener, ruler, cutter, pencils, pins, cardboards and thick sheet of paper. We know that total surface area of a sphere is 4 pi r square. Let us begin the activity. A ball representing a spherical object. Can you find the radius of this ball? What we have to do is we take two cardboard sheets and we place this ball in between of these two cardboard sheets in such a manner that the two cardboards are parallel to each other. So, the distance between these two cardboard pieces will represent the diameter of this sphere. And we know that the radius is equal to half the diameter. So, we are able to find the radius of this sphere. As we can see in this model, we have placed two cardboard pieces parallel to each other and in between is a sphere and this is the scale. The distance between these two cardboard pieces as we can see is nothing but 7 centimeters. So, diameter is let us denote it with D is equal to 7 centimeters and as I have told you before that radius is equal to half of diameter which is equal to 7 by 2 which is equal to 3.5 centimeters. Now what we have to do is on the surface of the sphere we have to choose any point and fix this boat pin. Say suppose here. As you can see this, this is a pin any on any part of the sphere. Now with the help of this thin thread we have to cover the sphere completely as what we have to find out the total surface area of a sphere. This I have make a knot, the extra portion I will cut it down with the help of a scissors. See this. Now with the help of this glue, now I am going to wrap this thread all over the surface of this sphere such a manner that no space is left uncovered. Now we are going to cover this ball. See, similarly we have to cover all this without any gap in between. As you can see, Similarly, we have to cover the surface of the sphere thoroughly and one I have done for you as you can see this. The ball is covered in this manner. Now what we have to take is we take thick sheet of paper and paste it on a cardboard and we with the help of a compass, we open the compass up to 3.5 centimeter and draw four circles of this radius. So as you can see, this is 3.5 centimeter and we draw 4 circles of radius 3.5 centimeter each. Can you tell me why we are drawing 4 circles of radius 3.5 centimeter? As we have to find the total surface area of a sphere which is equal to 4 pi r square. So, 4 pi r square means 4 times the area of a circle of radius r. These are 4 circles of radius 3.5 centimeters. Now, as we have already covered this ball with the help of a thin thread, now what we have to do is we unwind this thread and simultaneously start filling this thread in this region, in these all four regions. As you can see,
this is my thread again with the help of a glue. I will fill this thread in one of the regions. Again fill this thread in such a manner so that no space is left uncovered and there is no gap in between the threads. Again with the help of this glue. Similarly, you have to fill all these four circles. As you can see, I have already done one for you. As you can see, these four circles and you see that the sphere, this whole thread is completely filled in these four regions. As you can see that the total surface area of a sphere is 4 pi r square. That means this is a sphere and the surface of the sphere is equal to 4 times the area of one circle which is equal to as the radius of one circle is 3.5 centimeter. This verifies that the total surface area of a sphere is equal to 4 pi r square where r is the radius of a sphere. Thank you.